Hey guys, we're back on Wither and Weston. This is the first redstone video. I'm on one of my many redstone worlds and... Well, I thought I'd showcase this clock I made a long time ago. It can count almost... It has 10 million. It can count to 10 million. And... Well... I can't just have a clock with no use, so I made a maze, and I used the clock to time myself, and those are my records, but you may say, well, you made the maze, you know how it goes, so I made a randomly generating maze to time myself in, and the clock has a lot of different settings. I'll just show you. You can set it to, uh, it updates every one second, or every, or twice every second. And, you can just add one to any one. And if you're done using it, you can just flip this lever off and hit the set mode. Then all you have to do is well, flip these levers until it's at the zero. And then it will sometimes it doesn't work but for the first three it usually doesn't work but after that if you set it to it usually won't add one to this one uh, but something is wrong I'm gonna fix that See, it's hard to set, so in the next version of the clock, I was just going to make a push button and it sets itself. See, that one worked. But I'll just quickly demonstrate the randomly generating maze. It has two modes. This wasn't a really hard thing to make. It just took a long time. And you can just click this, and it's just a normal random maze, or you can click this, which is the one which where the maze changes while you're inside of it. So I'm gonna do timer mode. And then I'm gonna get the maze started. I'm just gonna see how long it takes for me to go through. So you know I don't know how to solve it. Right. And you can also change how quickly the maze changes while you're inside of it. Well, let me make sure it's going and... Oh wait, I have to set it to this. Wait, no. This. Alright, I'm going. Oh, it's terrible when that happens. The entrance to the second floor is in that corner. As you can tell right now, it's set to change pretty quickly. This is because it's just, sometimes it takes a long time to get stuck in a room and it changes like once every minute.
Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, so close. Ah, oh, last door. Yes. I'm going to stop the timer. And this light tells you the timer's on. 67. Oh. Oh, almost as quick as my record for this maze. Well, that was the... Oh, gotta turn it off. Just go over how it works. Well, this is just a timer. And then it goes here and it updates these two rows of randomizers this is just it just chooses a random one a cake or a cookie the cake puts out two and the cookie puts out one and if it, if it's the cookie it'll put out one and this will be off but if it's the cake it'll put out this and this will be on and it'll if it's on it, all of these go to just one random one of the doors and that's basically that I'll just set this later, and I'll turn this off. This, the complicated part was the control panel. Well, and this, I guess, I guess it was all pretty complicated, but it's not very compact. I miscounted when I was making it. And then, I just have random stuff in this world like this. I made this timer. And basically, once you turn the lever on, after like a few years, this light will come on. It's supposed to be like a really long delay thing, I don't know. And this is pretty much the last thing. This is, this world is just not very much. I just made this and this, really. This is just a lottery machine. You could, you could add more choices, but basically you choose which number you want. I'll just choose three. And then you throw in a coin. And it just chooses a random one. And if you get the right one, this is a reset. If you get the right one, I'm just going to choose three again. It gives you more gold. Ah. Come on. Oh, it's been four every time. Yes. Well, basically through that I've lost one. But this is it. Well, next time, I think soon I'm going to make a calculator or a computer. Or maybe something small. Maybe I can do a tutorial. Leave in the comments if you want a tutorial. Please. Well, sometime I'll do land world with like fights in the maze or this maze. Please comment, subscribe, and like this video, and I guess it's a pretty short one, but there's not much on this world. Sometime I'll do a tutorial on how to make a smaller version of this clock. And bye, see you next time.